Well, uh, since our last interview, we lost John Madden, age 85. Uh, did you know him at all? Yes. Real well. I got my Madden sweater, jacket. He, he, used to call, he was Fox, so and we was in and we was in FC, so Green Bay Tampa Bay was his game every year. I mean, he'd come down and we talk Fav and <laughs> joke and laugh. And Pat Summerall was a live Oak Florida boy. So, you know, he's on the 100 team with me with the Florida boys, with the greatest Florida team ever assembled. So, and he was a he was a punter, place kicker, Pat Summerall. Most people don't know that. So, you know, I had my Florida connection and then I had the man that didn't want to fly in a plane that led the Raiders in the greatest win percentage ever. So, I mean, he's a monster. The way he, the way he brought the game to a kid's level to an elementary level. I mean, it was just fun. It was just fun to listen to him. It was great to play the video game, and it was even better to meet him and you know, be be recognized by him as one of the one of the badasses in this game. And, and got my Madden jacket and my sweater. What do you think was your greatest memory with John Madden? Don't have one like that. It wasn't nothing personal. I've never listened to him do my game. I watched. This happened in 97. August 31st, 1997, the San Francisco game to start the year. I played one of my best games I've ever played. Jerry Glanville ass is up in that box talking about tickets to Elvis. Tickets for Elvis. That he used to leave tickets for Elvis. So I said to myself then, I would never let one of them assholes that's up there in that box steal my joy from playing this game. I'll just watch it without sound for the rest of my life and... I've never watched a, I've never watched another game, not even the Super Bowl, none of that. I've never watched a game where you can hear the sound of somebody talking over the game. Jerry Glanville was talking about giving tickets to Elvis. I couldn't believe it. And I had that made one of them down the line badass play. I was cussing at the TV. My homeboy looked at me and said, dog, we won the game. What are you doing? I'm like, fuck that big talking stupid. He ain't watching the damn game. And then I realized. When I got in the TV, they actually have a script that they're running now. They got a three-hour script that they're going through, and it doesn't matter what's in front of them. They're going through that script. I didn't know that then. I thought they were watching the game and actually was an expert on the game. Mm. No. Well, uh, John Madden was, and rest oh, in peace to a, one no, of the no. greats. John to, Madden to, was one, a one head of the all -time football greats. coach. When you're a head football coach that retired because the stress of not winning the big game or making it right to the championship game was too much every year, and you're winning 10 to 13 games a year. Unbelievable. I love that man. I love that man. Well, Warren Sapp, man, thank you for coming back. Seems like you're doing well since last time. You're healthy. Apparently, you're scuba diving and grabbing sharks and you no, know, no, doing no, all no. types of other crazy I shit. To, I tried not to grab the shark, Vlad. I got bit by one a couple years ago, and I realized then that razor sharp shit is real. They do right. have razor sharp teeth. So I'm going to stay safe, baby. And anytime you want to come talk to you, boy, you give me a buzz. That's what it is, man. I mean, our first interview, a lot of people actually commented how it was a little bit tense. And, you know, well, I just had someone in front of me that hadn't done their homework on me, and I found that to be a little disappointing. You know, this time around, I made sure I did my homework. I like it, baby. I like it. I love the interview. And, and the boy you done with, uh, my boy T to the motherfucking K Kirkland. Mm, right. That's my dog. That's my dog right there. You yeah. know that San he was he worked with Sandra Bullock all those years? TK's done everything with everybody. Period. Period. He was around for, for Jesus. Period. He was around Period. for Adam that, that's, and Eve. That's a, that's a great way of putting it. He's done it with everybody in so kind of way. Yeah, right That's there. right. All that's right. right. You know, it's gotten so... So big that if you look at any Vlad TV YouTube video, there's a fake TK Kirkland taking credit for whatever's happening in that particular video. Literally, every every Vlad TV YouTube video, and we have thousands of them. I there's love always it. there's always a fake TK Kirkland in there commenting about how he did this first. I you know love what I'm saying? It. I love it. I love it. He's the best. All right, baby, be good. I'm going to lunch. No doubt. Peace. Yes, sir.